What's up, Coach? It's Bryce from Synergy. Today, we're going to talk a little bit about trimming your clips in the Synergy editor. So this is for any editor user. I've pulled some clips from the team site, which you can see down below. Uh, I actually have a possession ready to go right here, possession two. Uh, I want to trim this clip up a little bit. It's a little bit stuff on the end and the start that I don't really want in the edit that I'm making. So I'd like to trim it up a little bit. Uh, and there's a couple different ways I can go about that. Um, it's really just up to you how you want to do it. <clears throat> We're going to go through the first way, which is for brand new people who have no idea what trimming is or how to do trimming in the first place with Synergy. Um, it's very simple. You can basically enter uh, sort of a new trimming mode. OK, and the way you do that is you can click this uh, scissors icon. OK, and when I click that, you see I've got these little markers that pop up at the end and start of a clip. And what I'll be able to do is click and drag them to wherever I want. Um, and then you can also click U to enter or exit that mode. So we'll go ahead and click U to enter the mode. Um, we'll let my clip run. And OK, right here, I think I want to start here. You can click pause with your space bar or on the video player with your mouse. And then you can just drag it to the desired location. If you're like me, you can use the hotkeys, uh, which are defaulted to I and O for in and out. And the nice part about that is, and this is really going to be helpful for people who haven't or have used Synergy and have experience using those hotkeys of INO, you can just use those hotkeys instead. So say that we're going back here, instead of dragging, I'll just go ahead and play the clip. And I've got my fingers ready to go on my I and O. And I decide, hey, right here, I'm going to press I. And then I don't have to pause it. It continues to play. And then I see what's going on. And again, I have the option right now, like for whatever reason, let's just assume I want to make an out point right now. I could hit pause and then I could certainly drag it over to this location right here, or I can just tap O. Great. So we've got our we've got our trimmed clip from here. Um, if you decide that these are not the trims that you want, you can quickly erase both of them at the same time by pressing U or deselecting this highlighted scissors icon. So if I click the scissors icon or tap U, they go away. OK. So something to think about. Uh, it used to be where you tapped I and you tapped I again. It would remove that endpoint. Same thing with O. That doesn't exist anymore. So if you're using I and O to create your ins and outs and you quickly want to remove those, just tap U or click the scissors. And that will make sure that you erase those ins and out points. Um, and other than that, you should be good. So hopefully that helps. Use your hotkeys I, in, O, out. Uh, U enters the mode. I and O enter the mode too. As you can see, I just tapped I. It enters the mode as well. Um, maybe here's my O. I'm done. I've got that you know trimmed and ready to go. I can add it to my custom edit. Um, I can maneuver it later on. So let us know if you have any questions. Make sure to contact our support team and feel free to drop a comment below if you need anything else. Have a great season and thank you for your business coach. Take care.